cracking filly. Um, love the way she walked, love the way she carried herself, uh, had a real presence about her. Probably more the thing I love about her is there's a pedigree. Um, I've had great success with So You Thinks in the past, but more so So You Thinks that have come into Sprinting Family. So really excited for the fact that we're getting a really nice So You Think filly in the barn, but with a few criteria that, that really appeal to me uh, and obviously appeal to the, the buyers that are coming in. So as I said, it's a um, good sprinter's family. Obviously you've got Belleville Hugh Group 2 winner. You've got the second dam on type, who was a good sprinter as well. Uh, raced uh, consecutively in city and, and was very competitive in group races. Uh, so yeah, good solid sprinting family. And he's been consecutively producing good horse for years now. Uh, group 1 winners, uh, we can run through names, but there's so many of them out there. And, I just think he's been an outstanding stain and, and he's, he's well proven. I think buying of good farms is very important, um, but buying of Sejano, which is a, a, a leading stakes producing farm, is great. Uh, I've also got Rocking Bio come from the farm, obviously another So You Think, and he's obviously won uh, good races, uh, including two and a half million in prize money. Well, I hope she's better, to tell you the truth. Um, but she's got, got a lot of the stuff that, that I'm looking for in a So You Think. He was out of a good sprinting family and and so she, so uh, as I said, really happy to be getting a hold of a, of a, a nice filly by staying that's well proven out of a sprinting family, knowing that's coming off of a really good farm and uh, happy to be getting involved with uh, Crinda Bloodstock with another horse.